Hello everyone, this is Stefan and I'm going to talk about sample data installation for Storex theme. Uh, so once you have installed this theme, you may want to install sample data for it. Why would you want to do that? Well, uh, sample data helps your site look like our demo site right here on storex.themes.dome. And uh, this can be a great example for you and you can just then edit the existing site and um, this can be of a big help. So how do you make your site look like this one? Um, first of all, you need to install the sample data installer plugin. This plugin is located in the required plugins folder of your theme download, but you will have to add it manually um, because otherwise this plugin could potentially destroy your database. You should be really careful about using this plugin. You must not run sample data installer plugin on an already existing site or a multi-site WordPress installation because it will just wipe your database out and you may lose everything you have built so uh, passionately and hardly throughout these years, all your products, all your data. So you should run sample data installer plugin on a clean WordPress and theme install only, like this one. This is a fresh theme install and I want to make it look like our demo site. So what do I do? I'll go, I go to plugins, add new, and then I choose upload plugin and I browse my computer. I go to the download theme, I go to the required plugins and I find this plugin there, sample data installer. And I open it and press install now. Um, after that, I have to activate this plugin and this may take some time. While the plugin is being activated, we also need to put the uploads, uh, you know, all the images and all the graphic files you see on our live demo, if you want them on your um, site as an example, so you can later replace them with uh, your own um, images and icons and things like that, you should download the uploads folder. And the link to it you can find under this video and um, you should load it uh, to the VP content folder of your WordPress install. Oh, well, you may have, you may already have an uploads folder there, but uh, well, just go ahead and merge those files. Copy this one and paste it here. It's almost 200 megabytes. So if you use FTP, because I'm using local host right now, so it's, it's a fast process, but once you use FTP, it may take a while, so you have to be patient about it. And here we go. Uh, the required plugins, uh, the required, uh, sim sorry, sample data installer plugin has been activated. We have to log back into our WordPress install. And let's take a look what we have here. All right. So we have something that looks quite like our um, sample data site, but many images are. Oh, no, they are here already because we have uploaded the uploads folder. But anyway, um, you, you still have to, it, it, it's better to do the thumbnail rebuild because some images may not show up. So you have to go to tools, rebuild thumbnails and rebuild all thumbnails. This may take a little bit, uh, but it's, it's not too much of a long process. It's, just a couple of minutes, probably. Now for now, we can just browse the site and take a look at it and see that. It, uh, oh, you see that some products are missing, the images are missing. Once we are done rebuilding thumbnails, the images will be there. And um, you can see the link structure. 
should be working. Yeah, it, it does. But the images are not there yet. And we are waiting for them. Okay, so uh, a few minutes later, uh, our uh, thumbnails were rebuilt. And we can now see that product images are there on their places. And probably the last thing we should do is we need to uh, reset permalinks. Um, in, in the common settings area, the post name should be chosen like it is. And in the optional and uh, product permalink base, the shop base with category option should be chosen. And you then just hit save changes. And here we go. Sample data has been installed and your site right now looks like our demo site and you can go ahead and replace the images and replace texts and put your own products in there uh, and go ahead and start selling.